Hi, I'm Felix Chen from China Daily. Now I'm at Global Sources. With me, it's Amy from Robot C. So now Amy's holding a yellow fish. I don't know what's that. It's a toy or something. Can you tell me something about that, Amy? Uh, his name is Vicky. It's a uh, consumer used uh, a robot fish. Uh, you can use it to uh, capture picture or video uh, in the water. Uh, it's done on the basis of bionic and hydromechanic theory and driven by the common vortex, uh, uh, which uh, developed by the uh, swing of the bionic fin. And uh, it featured with high text such as uh, the eccentric plant you had, the uh, underwater acoustic communication, and the GPS. Uh, the uh, restraint of using a wire to control the uh, small to medium sized uh, RUV is broken through by using Wi Fi and a, uh, a sonar controller for operation. So it's controlled by a remote control or a phone app, something? Yes, uh, when it's on the water, you can control it by the app in your smartphone. Uh, while it's on the water, uh, you can control it by a so uh, sonar controller. How deaf can this uh, drone can go down to? Uh, uh, the maxi uh, depth is uh, uh, 6-0, uh, 60 meters. So, uh, what can I, so how can I use this drone, you know, like for its tr travel, like for, yeah? Uh, yes, uh, you can take it to uh, travel while uh, you're traveling to an island or uh, swimming uh, in the pool. Uh, okay. So is it on the market already or it's a... Uh, yes, yes uh, you can, uh, it's available on Kickstarter and Indiegogo. Okay, thank you very much, Amy. Thank you. Thank you.